we'll well. go ahead and get started. Uh, well, Zach Eady, Braden Smith, Lance Jones will be here. Oh, you you should have. Uh, you should raise your hand. We'll get a microphone to you. Well, same thing. Go ahead. Uh, Braden, Zach, whoever wants to take this. No turnovers in the first half. Coach is promising anything nice for half without turnovers or anything. And what was the key to just not giving the ball over to Michigan at all? I mean, yeah, I think it was cool in the first half. We really took care of the ball, and it obviously helps when we make shots as well. Um, and that's just kind of the what we try to do every game. But it's just sometimes shots don't fall. And then, of course, I got to screw it up and get the turnover in the second half. But whatever. But. Lance, uh, watching you tonight kind of remind of, reminded me of seeing you in Carbondale with the amount of shots you were able to get. How good is it for you to be able to fall back on the way you once played at your former school to be able to apply it here? You don't always have to do it, but you are able to do it when you need to, and you did today. Uh, yeah, I think I just you know, uh, kind of got in the rhythm of the game. Um, you know, I kind of let it come to me in the beginning. I didn't force anything. Uh, was kind of playing off of Zach, and uh, you know, Braden found me in my in my, in, the, in my spot, so uh, I felt good tonight. For anyone uh, coming into the game, what was your plan to try to stop Michigan's offense? Um, I mean, there's a lot of a lot of things I could say right there. Um, I think kind of the main things that we kind of focus on every game is just re winning the rebound battle, winning the turnover battle, and I think we did that today. Zach, both of Michigan centers fouled out tonight. Um, what was the game plan to attack them and get them off the court? Yeah, they tried to um, stay one-on-one, -on -one, just be physical a lot of times. Um, and that kind of happens. Um, they're, they're both really good players. They're both really strong players. Um, but, I mean, you can only be, be so physical. Hey, Zach, right over here. Easy question. Carson hits the three. How special are these guys that, you know, work their butt off all the time in practice? And what, what's it mean for you to see those guys succeed? It's big. I mean, I think we've got the best scout team in America. Um, I mean, they're really good. They're all really good. They can all play. Uh, they really help us win games, honestly. Um, they give us good looks in practice on uh, what the other team's kind of offense would look like. Uh, they always kind of know the plays. They know everything. They're, they're, I think we have the best scout team in America. <clears throat> Zach, you've, you've carried this team through stretches this year, but for the first 12 minutes, you didn't score. And kind of what your teammates did and how they kept the offense going there. Yeah, I mean, it's, 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 it's like so much bigger than me. I mean, I'm not, we're not the Purdue Zach Eadies, we're the Purdue Boilermakers. Like, we've got so many guys that can go, we've got so many guys that can really score, really make plays. Like, you see it today, we just, they, they all step up when I need them to step up. And, uh, made big plays. Braden was big for us. Lance was big for us. Uh, everyone made plays. Is that an NIL opportunity for you, Zach? <laughs> no, that's not what we need to do. Um, Lance, you've had a good stretch of games ever since you went viral for that dance, ironically enough. Just what is <laughs> – has anything clicked there? Or just what have you been doing? Um, I would say just playing with confidence. Um, I mean, these guys believe in me, uh, so it's really up to me to believe in myself and uh, in times of need. Um, so just going out there with the utmost confidence, uh, you know, has helped me along the way. Zach, you kind of mentioned rebounding, and I thought Caleb did a good job tonight. Trey did a good job tonight. Obviously, Cam and Mason are a big boost there. Just how competitive are practices for the boards when you guys really get into scrapping it? Obviously, you don't want to get each other hurt, but I imagine there's some wars there during practice. Yeah. Um... Yeah, it's physical, all out. Everyone like, everyone's really goes out through every ball. Everyone, that's the, kind of our thing, just playing hard. So when it gets to practice time, it can get really, really physical. Hey, Braden, I think three of your four field goals came at the rim. <clears throat> uh, did you make a concerted effort to get to the rim, or were things just opening up for you, or what all happened there? Um, I just made the read. They kind of just gave me the lane, and <clears throat> just glad I made a layup for once. Um, kind of had a struggle here. The past two games, so I was just kind of excited to see a couple fall. Lance, which was more impressive for you, your five threes or your three steals? My three steals. Um, yeah, I would definitely say my three steals. <clears throat> I mean, I was kind of uh, just waiting on the perfect time to, you know, try to pick his pocket, and uh, I got two of them tonight. So I would say my my three steals. 
Lance, one more question for you. I watched a documentary, fantastic. What does this Purdue team mean to you? Everything. Uh, they've helped me through so much. Uh, I'm forever grateful. And, um, you know, I wouldn't trade being with these guys for the world. So uh, this team means everything to me. Brian Lessel. Hey, Zach, I'm going to ask you a stupid question. Um, how much do you admire your own dunks? Pardon? How much do you admire your own dunks after the fact? Um, I mean, not at all. I <laughs> trying, to, trying to get back on defense. Um, obviously, it feels cool to dunk. It feels cool to dunk on people. Um, I'm not sure if I admire them. <laughs> it's cool to do it, for sure. So you don't go home at night and watch it? No. <laughs> no. Is there anything else? Cool. Thank you, guys. How much did you admire Brian Waddell's dunk? Ooh, that was really yeah. good. <laughs> I definitely admire Carson Barrett's three.